as we got married, he decided um, we're no longer going to use a condom. I'm like, dude, what the hell? Mm. You know, what's the story? And he's like, but I'm married to you now, so it doesn't matter, actually. Like, okay. So you're supposed to continue to use condoms? Yes. I even in marriage, right? Correct. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Unless you are trying for a baby at that time. Mm -hmm. um, and then, obviously, the doctors will give him um, pre prep. Yeah, yeah, prep pills, yes. yes. I've read of those, yeah. Yes. So that we can try and then... Um, but I don't think a lot of people know that actually that you can still have sex and conceive a child naturally. You can with yeah. when when you're HIV positive. Yes, you can. You can. And by the way, you know, I only started taking my my ARVs when I came to Good Stories. Prior to that, I never used to take them. So you were living with it for how long before you started? For eight years. <laughs> HS. So your life, did your life actually change no, in any way? I never became sick. I was never sick. Um, like, life was normal. I was partying like everyone else. I was drinking like everyone else. I still am partying and drinking like everyone else. Your um, mom's going to see this. <laughs> no, I drink <laughs> a with, little bit. Uh, yeah, like water. Yes, drink water, water yes. only, mom. Mm. Mm. Good for the soul. <laughs> Good for the soul. Yes, I drink water. Okay. Yes, no, at home though, like, we still, we drink from a mug. Yeah, to hide it. <laughs> I, do, I, do, I feel like my parents know, but... Yeah, they know. That time the, 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 the mug is red here from the wine. <laughs> <laughs> no, we still, we still drink from a mug. Yeah. We, still drink. we can't do that, yeah. And then, so, so, so dating after your marriage? Oh, yeah, so I got divorced. Um, but I, I had baby during my marriage, very early, early in the marriage. Um, because I wasn't really using any contraceptive mm. and him saying that he's not longer going to uh, condomize came out of nowhere for me. So yeah, I had baby, baby's neg. That's the only time actually that I took ARVs mm -hmm. so that I don't expose baby. Oh, so if, if, if you're having a baby, yes. you have to take them so Correct. that you don't expose the baby. Yes. Okay. And then when I gave birth, the doctor's like, oh, no, your CD4 counts is fine. You don't, or the... So you had a normal doctor. birth, everything yes. was fine. Yeah, all as well. They're not doctors, what are they? Uh, what? Pedi no, not a pediatrician. Pediatrician. Gynae. Gynae, yes, okay. Yeah, my guy. <laughs> <laughs> My guy here is just like, no, you're fine. You know, yeah. like, you don't have to carry on. It's up to you. If you want to carry on, you can carry on yeah. taking them. I was like, no, I don't want to. Like, I don't want to take this pill. It's so big as well. So, no. It's huge. It I've seen huge. them. Yeah. It's very huge. And then, yeah, so got divorced. Mm. And then now I'm, I'm single. Okay. Are you looking to date? I am. Single life is How long have you been single for now? No, I've been single on and off. So. Oh, single on and off. <laughs> <laughs> You've been seeing people. Yeah, but, but I do tell. But I, yeah. as I was saying, yeah. I do tell. But now single, she's, I think from August last year. Yeah, that's over, yeah. You know what I mean? I mean, I was single for like two years yeah. uh, before. Yeah. yeah, just because. But for me now, there's a lot in my mind. It's daughter, it's. W question, yeah. with your daughter, did you breastfeed? No, you're, and you're not, not allowed. Not, no, we can. We okay. can. You can. Uh, you have to. The, the the doctor said for six months without mixing with anything else, right? Okay. Like no formula, no anything. Other, just the breast milk. Um, but the first night where I gain, where I, when I gave birth to her, my milk didn't come out. So and she was crying. But that's also but normal. That is it, it happens very to, normal. Yeah, yeah. My, yeah. And then. We gave her formula, then apparently I was then told I can't then give her breast milk anymore. Okay. Yeah, so they gave me, then two days later, m my milk started to come out. And then you were able to breastfeed? No. Oh, because so you already yes, started so with, with formula. the formula. So I had to take uh, pills to stop the milk. Oh, that must have been so, ne? It was. It was. I'm so sorry. I've had, oh, like so many of my friends have babies now and they're complaining about nipple pain. Well, luckily, I didn't have to do it. But much. like the full, okay, never yeah, mind. It wasn't, <laughs> it wasn't much because it, was, it didn't last that long. You know, yeah, like, yeah. Because yeah. they gave me pills to make the milk stop, to dry up. Okay. Yeah. 
Okay, cool. And you have a beautiful, happy baby girl. Yes, I do. She's stunning. Hey? She has such a personality. I know, right? Like mommy. Yeah. And she's pretty like mommy. She's gorgeous. I know, right? I mean, maybe a little bit prettier than mommy. No! I'm joking! <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. Have and so when do you that. think, because I mean, when do you think you're going to start having the conversation with her about HIV? As soon as she can reason. Mm. Yeah, as soon as she can make sense of it what it is, what it's doing. Like, I want to, I don't want to just bombard her with something that she's like, oh, okay, and then yeah. it goes off. Yeah. I want her to be smart enough or, yeah, to, for her to take it in and know what it is. Mm. Yeah. And take it seriously, I guess, Correct. as well. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's hmm. very interesting. Yeah. So, but yes, I do want to get married again. And you want to have more kids? Two more. So you want three, like me. <laughs> I still have a long way to go. How old were you when you had your first child? 28. 28. 28. Yeah. So, so next year's my lucky year. I'm yeah. just going to rub yeah. some 28 energy. You can get it <laughs> on. on. You can so get it on. I can just <laughs> next year we do the things. Yeah. Okay. The best. I, think, I think one thing that I've taken from this, you know, is that there's, a, there's such a huge misconception that people mm. are the ones that get HIV or get any kind of sickness, you Correct. know, STDs and all of that. And they don't realize that there are people out there living mm. with um, the virus and they don't know. Precisely. You know? Yeah. So I know you kept mentioning that you were doing everything right. You were a good girl. Um, and, and, and I think if there's anything that I take away from this is that you you can literally live the best life and sometimes life just happens yeah definitely obviously definitely. you need to be as cautious as you can mm. be um but i mean needles as well you know um um and you know being with people who are dishonest i mean mm. everyone that you've been around is so lucky that you've been telling them the truth yeah because i feel for me it is just my own conscience like mm. i don't want to go out there and think I've infected someone. Like yeah. I just feel like it's unfair. But you can get arrested for that, right? I don't know. Can you? I think so. I think you can get arrested for, for like, mm. having sex with someone, knowing that you have HIV, and they get him. I think so. I'll Google don't it. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> we'll ask good Do stories. We'll have a session on good Let's stories. Let's have a session on good stories. Yeah, yes. and find out. Yeah. yeah. Because I think I've... I've, I've Maybe it's in the States, because if you know, I think yeah. you're supposed to tell someone. Oh, so it makes like, sense, though, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, I've learned a lot. Seriously? I have, especially about the breastfeeding thing. I'm in a very okay. broody stage in my life, so, <laughs> no, <laughs> so yeah, anything yeah. child-related, I'm very yeah. interested in. Cool. Well, Pumzil, it was so nice to meet you. Um, thank you for being so open. and. Oh, your pleasure. Uh, yeah, continue teaching people, even if it's just your friends. Hey? I am, and yeah. I will, because it's not a death sentence, right? Mm. It's not the end of the world. It's not written on my face. So, yeah. Thank Life, you. we must live it to the best. Yes, the and we shall. Yes. And we're going to go have some clean drinks together. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> much that was yeah, that sure. was such a beautiful conversation it was um i think for me the most important thing that i took away was how you owned it from the get-go you never blamed anyone else it was always um i should have protected myself because too many times we find people who say ujabu infected me and then they want to go and blame ujabu uh, mm. And like he was, I don't know, I can't remember if you said, but he probably doesn't know or mm. he didn't mm. know. Mm. Um, but the most important thing is for you to protect you. Yes. And okay. and I think it's it's that's the uh, that's the one thing that I take away the most. And I mean, your daughter is amazing, right? Yes. She is, she's, she's gorgeous. She's gorgeous. She looks just like me. What? <laughs> <laughs> Though I am not the father, I, I, I don't own anything. But I mean, I'm ready for kids too. Have mm. them then. Yeah. I'm also ready for children. Yeah, good <laughs> <laughs> I 
father. I'm sure. I'm sure. So guys, thank you very much. Thank you for hooking this up. Yeah, this is this was yeah, amazing. Was good. So do, was nice. Did the lines connect? Did the parallel lines connect? Yes. Yes. Here and there, I guess. yes. Yeah, I think so. It's yeah. a good place. Definitely. I guess cool. it's mission accomplished. Yeah. And Thank guys, you. we will see you then next week. Awesome. Cool.